back or welcome to my channel. So today, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to do these super easy stacked leggings. Y'all know these leggings are super popular and it's real easy, you can do it by yourself at home and not pay your arm and a leg for these daggone leggings. So if you wanna see how to achieve these leggings, then keep on watching. So what you're gonna need are two pair of leggings. I got these from Amazon. I got a small and a medium. I'm gonna use the small for like the upper part of the legging. And I'm gonna use the medium pair of leggings for like the bottom part, the um, the stack part. So they like, you know, so they're like big enough. The, the leg is wide enough. You know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm trying to say. So I got a medium to do the stacked part of the pants with. I got these off Amazon and they're gray rib leggings. I wanted some rib leggings, that's why. It's been taking me so long to film this video. I was supposed to film this after I did those Samaria Leah inspired denim shorts but I couldn't find leggings I wanted to use, like the material I wanted. So I found these on Amazon and these kept selling out. So they finally restocked and I got these off Amazon. And you'll need your sewing machine, obviously, and a pair of scissors. So first thing you wanna do is try on your leggings, the pair of leggings that are gonna be like the upper part of the leggings. So you can see where you wanna cut at to start the stacked part of the leggings. So. Let's go do that. So before I try on the leggings, we're actually gonna go ahead and cut out the part that's gonna be the stacked part of the leggings. So we're gonna take the medium size pair of leggings and we're just gonna cut all the way up as far as we can go. So like right here. So we'll have all this to work with for the stacked part. So we're gonna go ahead and cut that out. All right, so now we have our stack part, so we're gonna flip these upside down because this is how they're gonna go on the pants. So you now the flare part will be at the bottom, like that. So we're gonna connect this to wherever we cut on the other pair of leggings. So let's try those on now. All right, so here are the small pair of leggings on. So we're gonna see where we wanna cut to attach these. So let's just go ahead and put it on so we can kind of get an idea. All right, um, I think that looks pretty good. I think this is as good as it's gonna get, as stacked or scrunched as it's gonna get. So um, I'm gonna say we can cut right here. So like, what is this? Maybe two and a half, three inches from my kneecap. So that's where I'm gonna cut at. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and cut and then attach here. So let's do that. All right, so I made a little mark here with like a dry erase marker. So I'm gonna cut and I fold the leggings in half so they'll be even on both sides, duh. So we're gonna cut right here. And this is where we're gonna attach our stack pieces to these leggings here. Okay, so now we're gonna turn these inside out. So let's go ahead and do that. All right, hopefully you guys can see what I'm doing. So I've turned them inside out. So here's our left leg. So we're gonna take the left piece that we cut off of the medium pair of leggings and we're gonna attach ankle to ankle. So the end part of each pair of leggings, that's where we're gonna be sewing and attaching them. So, so we're not gonna turn these pieces inside out, the pieces that are gonna be the stack part, We're just going to, um, we're gonna put the wider part up here and match up the seams. So here and here so that they're even. So now we're gonna take our sewing machine. Luckily, um, I'm at my cousin's house in Savannah. Luckily her sewing machine has already been threaded with gray thread. So the bobbins are already threaded, all that good stuff. So I don't even have to do nothing. So we're just gonna sew a stitch all the way around and that's it, that's literally it, y'all. This DIY is so easy. If you know how to use a sewing machine, of course. You could do it by hand, you know, the whole over under thing. It's just gonna take longer, but yeah. So I'm gonna get some pins and pin it so um, it'll stay in place, obviously. And then we're gonna sew all the way around. All right, so we're all pinned up all the way around. So now we're just gonna sew right across, that's it. We're gonna take this off so maybe I can slide this around this part.
So both of our pieces are attached now. As you can see, it's attached. So now we're gonna repeat the same thing on the other leg. And now back stitch. And boom. So we can flip them on the right side now and try them on. All right, so this is what you should have. This is where you connected your leggings here. And there you have it. Now you have a pair of stacked leggings that you don't have to pay the arm and the leg for. So I'm switching over to my phone now. My camera just died when I tried on the leggings. How convenient. Um, I'm actually gonna hem. You can leave the edges of your leggings, like the flared part at the bottom with these raw edges if you want to. I think I'm gonna hem mine. And I also saw in somebody's video that if you want like the scrunch look all the way up the side of the leggings, then to just run a stitch all the way down the outside parts of the leggings and then pull the strings before you cut them and it should scrunch it. So I'm gonna try that too. We'll see if that works or not. But um, I'm gonna hem this right quick. All I'm doing is folding it like this. It'll be folded all the way around. And I'm gonna sew all the way across that. So I'm gonna do that. We have nice clean edges now on our leggings, period. So let's try this stitch all the way up the outsides of the leggings to see if we can scrunch the sides. If it don't work, I'll be mad, but let's try it anyway. Okay, actually we're not gonna do that because now I'm scared. Cause see, um, there's no seam on the outside of these pants to follow. I know in the video that I watched, they had a seam to follow. So all I had to do was sew on that seam. I'm scared that my stitch won't be straight and then the scrunching will be crooked and all that. Cause see the seam is on the inside of these leggings. See it's right here and not on the outside. So you know what, we're gonna leave it like this. It's good enough for me. So let's try them back on again. <laughs> all right, so here you have it. Super easy, there you have it, stacked leggings. It's that easy. Well, that's it for this video. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, please. And thank you. And make sure post notifications are on so you don't ever miss my post because you don't want to do that. And I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.